bacon in a Levco skillet, cast iron skillet. This will be its first cook after being cleaned and reseasoned. Okay, that's the way I always did bacon, whether it was non-stick, cast iron, stainless steel, whatever. I'll layer the whole pound in there. And I haven't even turned the stove on yet. Well, uh, started out cooking her slow. It'll build up its own heat as it as it goes. So we'll come back to that. Get a. We got our bacon layered in our pan. And turn this to five. Um, this burner has two burners or one has a big one has a small one. I'm going to start on the big ones here, and it almost covers the whole bottom. So we'll we'll stick with that. Oh, maybe not. I uh, will start out slow anyways. Um, yeah, I've never thrown bacon into a hot pan. Uh, I've watched a couple YouTube videos. Uh, what is it? Uh, Great Depression Cooking with Clara. And everything she cooks started out in a cold pan. She was using modern day non-stick. But uh, I'm sure in the Depression all they had was cast iron. Okay, you can see them there starting to... Put some heat on. We will uh, do a stick. Oh, they're not sticking. Now we got to let it go a little bit longer. I'm trying to edit another video, so I'm sort of neglecting this. But anyways, we'll come back. Okay. Now oh, some most of the water's come out of it. Mix her around. Just still on low. Now we'll let the since the water coming out of it. Now we'll let the fat start coming out of it. And this is where it's got the potential to stick, but I think I'll be all right. Oopsie daisy. Yeah, okay, I've turned the heat down. These are these are doing all right. Not sticking. If I just let it fry real hard without moving them around, yeah, probably would. Just about every pan. Except for new age, space age, Teflon. Which ain't no freaking good for you. I got Teflon and my mom bought me Heritage Rock whole set. I used them for a couple years and then discovered cast iron. Now I don't use them at all. Uh, I think I still use sauce pots. But... I try not to use them if I don't have to. Alright, I won't come back until this is uh, pretty much done. Alright. This is done. For the way I like it, I don't like them super crispy. We will put them on the paper towel to drain. Even though we love all that fat. That's what makes it taste good. They say fat is flavor, so I must be fucking delicious. Alright, you can see some. Some it's stuck. You know, really. No big deal. It won't take much to get that off. Pretty good for the first cook. Okay. Here's that pot from. Pot. Skillet from last night, cooking bacon in it. Uh, so next day, I let the bacon get hard and just scooped it out with the wooden spatula. I got it on the stove here, just heating it up a little bit. Uh, we'll wash her up and see how she does. There's stuff stuck on it, but I mean, it's not going to be stuck on hard. So it'll it'll be fine. There, right, I got the pan heated up a little bit. Got the hot water going. There's a pretty good brush here. This brush is almost like the lodge brushes. I wasn't going to pay 15 bucks for one lodge brush when I could get three of these for 20. They were just as good. Nice hard bristle. Got this little point here to scrape on. Yep. Right. We'll clean her up, see how she does. Might be a win, might be a fail. I don't know. 
probably should have did this first thing when it was still hot, but no matter. I'll get her clean. I'm not afraid of elbow grease. Oh, too bad. There's some spots. Nothing really. Couple sticky spots, but. And when I'm done, I'm going to wipe her down, put her back on the stove. Clean her up, make sure there's no moisture. Looks pretty good. I think it passed. Not bad for first seasoning. That's what I like. Don't matter. Don't matter if you're seasoning. I'll, sh I'll show you some stuff I got that doesn't look good, but it's fine for cooking. Now I just got some grease from here. Do the outside of the pan. I might give this a little inside coating after but I'm gonna leave the outside. Let's get her on the stove. Okay, get her back on the stove heating up. There's some spots. I mean nothing stuck. Change the seasoning a little bit. Ooh, that's a little warm. I'll probably put a, a little small coat of oil on it. Very very thin layer. We'll come back to that after it's warm. Okay, take a bit of olive oil here. That's probably too much. That doesn't matter. We're going to uh, wipe it on. Wax on, wax off. We're not going to bother with uh, doing the bottom or anything like that. Don't need it. Here's that. I'm going to use a shop towel because they are super absorbent. There you go. Your seasoning is going to change. Thanks. There's a beauty left go. Oops. This thing is incredible. I don't have any other pan. American, Canadian, Chinese, Taiwan. That is as smooth as this is. This is incredible. I wish I wish we had feel of vision. That is a very nice pan.